Hello ladies and gentlemen, my name is Obaku and welcome back to Let's Play Deus Ex Human Revolution Director's Cut. This is episode 15. I hope you guys are having a wonderful day and that you do whatever you like to do. Also, if you're enjoying this series, please don't forget to leave a comment and hit the like button. I really appreciate that. Some feedback. Positive or negative is always good. Look at this giant police robot. I don't want to be fighting you. No, no. Okay, so our mission is we need to go finding. Uh, yeah, Sandoval. That that's it. We gotta get to his apartment. His apartment is pretty close. I will never get used to this stuttering. When I play a game, I like it to be, you know, fluid. That everything is working correctly. I can jump like a Spider-Man with that augmentation I took. Fucking hell! They they are actually hostile. I didn't know. I didn't know. Oh well. What do you guys think? Should I change my 10 millimeter pistol for a revolver? You could do that, I didn't even try the revolver. Okay, my dog is barking, I'm sorry for that. Let's take revolver. Let's take ammo. And let's give it a try. Just a moment, I'm gonna... I'm gonna... Open the door for my dog to get out. There it is. Okay, we can continue. Is this the right place? I've already been here. Oh, oh. That was a trap. We almost died. You over there? Keep hiding, Hanser. Hanser's gone. Got no honor, man. Die. <sighs> nice ambush there, not gonna lie. This is not even the place it looks like. Hmm. 
should be on this floor. Should be through this. How do I get through this? Staircase. I need to get to the staircase. Nope. Well, I have one more thing to try. Praxis. Blast through weakened walls. How do I blast? It's two buildings here. Maybe I'm in the wrong building. I just acquired a Praxis update, but I don't know how to use it. Blast through weakened walls. I guess I cannot blast through this. Okay, let's see. Let's get out of this building and try to find another way to the staircase. Confused now. It should be here, but I don't see any other way in. Don't burn, don't burn.
This is the only inside, uh, the only way in, I mean. There it is. Bunch through the wall. Richard, looks like Sandoval's got a secret bunker. I'm gonna flush him out. Let's hope he's still there. Hey, did you hear that? This is the spot, man. Wait a second. You ain't supposed to. I ain't supposed to be here, that's what you've meant? Well, I got here. What can you do now? Ooh. I don't think they can get here. I hear them, but... No, I'm not here. You don't know where I am. Come to daddy. <clears throat> That's how you do it. They all had a shotgun. Laser system. More shotgun ammo. Reset the alarm. I guess I can deactivate that. What is true here? Nothing. Okay. Let's deactivate those lasers, hopefully. Last through. 
There's a candy bar here, hidden. <laughs> wow. And this is why I urge every member of my staff, every man and woman dedicated to the true mission of the Humanity Front, to do the same. I say yes. If you're watching this, I beg you, do not allow misplaced anger to destroy everything we have struggled to achieve. It's over. He knows I can't come back from that. Everybody knows, Sandoval. You can't hide from what you've done. What I've done, Mr. Jensen? I spent years patching people back together from augmentation botched jobs and systemic organ rejection brought on by implants. And now, because of Bill's betrayal, I'll never practice medicine again. You really want to help someone? Tell me where Seraph scientists are. I wish I could, Mr. Jensen. But my involvement ended right after I failed to remove their GPLs. You failed? Turns out, my surgical skills weren't good enough to bypass David Seraph's insurance policy. So for all I know, those little implants are broadcasting right now. On a frequency so low, your network specialist wouldn't think to look for it. You changed the frequencies. You have your answers, Mr. Jensen. And I've lost all of mine. The courts may think I have much to atone for, but my court will be a higher one. How about I take that gun with me when I go? You got everything you came for. Please, just leave. Believe it or not, I'd rather you didn't kill yourself. That's because you have no idea what tortures I've endured. The guilt, the shame. I was told the scientists would be used to find a peaceful solution to the augmentation crisis. Instead, I was involved in kidnapping and murder. My life ended that night. It's time for me to go. Think about it. Are you really in such a hurry to face that higher court of yours? At least there are no lies before God. Did you see that abominable press conference? William Taggart all but accused me of terrorism. He claimed that all the violence committed in the name of our cause was the result of my influence. So stay alive long enough to tell him your side of the story. He already knows it isn't true. I trusted that man. For years I gave him loyal service and he betrayed me. He sacrificed my freedom and good name to save the reputation of his organization. It's no use fighting him. He'll just spin it again. At least if I die, he'll never be able to use me again. Don't kill yourself because of that asshole. So tell your side of the story to the press. Swear at your trial that you're a better person than him. You want a peaceful solution to the augmentation crisis? Every camera in the country is going to be pointed at you. Use it to make a case. Convince people. Bill Taggart already controls public opinion. You can try to lift my spirit all you want, Mr. Jensen, but the facts don't change. Medicine was not enough for me, and neither was humanity front because I still saw people suffering every day. I knew it was insane to go along with the kidnapping plan. I knew it! But I had to do something. Others may be able to live their lives indifferent to the human misery around them, but I simply cannot. Not good. Well, if inspiring is not helping him, then... Empathize or tough love. I'm 
So you've had a couple of setbacks. Your reputation is shot, and you're going to jail. Fine. Killing yourself is not the way to find redemption. At least behind bars, you still have a chance to help people. You're smart, healthy, and educated. You know that. I refuse to accept that my salvation will be found in an institution designed to create misery and perpetuate suffering. I'd rather die. Pritchard, get this. We failed. The GPLs are still transmitting. Sandoval switched them to a lower frequency. But, but they could be broadcasting anywhere in the world. I don't have the type of equipment we'll need to find them. It's our only lead, Pritchard. You have to do something. I know. Listen, the riot's still blocking the street entrance. Head back to your apartment and Malik will fly you over. Maybe by the time you get here, I'll have figured out something. I failed. He killed himself, unfortunately. I want the world to know that we I tried to save him, but everything I said didn't work for him. Oh well. It is what it is now. Life goes on, we must continue doing our work. GPLs are still active just on a different frequency. Mm, we got ammo capacity upgrade. And we're gonna go with shotgun. Hostiles here, good. It got pretty cold in Croatia. I think winter is actually coming. My air conditioner is working right now, but I think I should put some better clothes because I'm getting kind of colder here in my room. How many praxis I got? Two. See through walls? Yes, baby. That's what I wanted. Track threads through the walls. Activation manual. Okay, now I can see my enemies through the wall. That should be interesting. Take a look. Activate cloak, typhoon, some smart vision. F3 should be. They have to activate to see through the wall. Yeah, and it's using my my energy. Okay, okay, okay. I understand. Okay, we fly with Malik again. It's his helipad, rooftop access. 
right on time. Nice detective work, Jensen. You ready to return to HQ? I'm ready. Yeah. Let's hope Pritchard's found that frequency. You said it. Back to HQ. Hey, I got a message for you, Jensen, from Pritchard. He says he's not in the office. Great. So what exactly am I supposed to do? I don't know. He said you should check in with the boss. Okay, we need to meet Sari first in the penthouse. Even if it was true that we were breeding a bunch of augmented soldiers and training them, what do they think stopping us from going home and throwing a bunch of rocks is gonna do? Well, I guess at all times. It's that bitch. Don't watch that. <laughs> I turned off the television, but I still look at it. Okay. Guards are on the guard. Who are you? Seraph? David's just stepped out for a moment, Mr. Jensen. But do come in. I've been hoping to meet you. Mr. Darrow. I'm surprised you even know who I am. David speaks very highly of you. He says that when it comes to detective work, you are like a dog with a bone. Have you found your scientist yet? What else did David tell you? Over the years, plenty. But today I'm here as a friend and fellow scientist. Things are getting quite turbulent out there, wouldn't you agree? So many people drunk on revolution. The United Nations being urged to intervene. And all because of the technology I created. Things have come a long way since then. Haven't they? And now my old friend David wants me to lead us to the promised land. He's asked me to invite members of the UN to Panchea to convince them we don't need industry regulation. Your geoengineering project in the Arctic Ocean. The installation couldn't have been built without the assistance of augmented workers. And when it's finished, my little hole in the ocean is going to stop global warming. A lovely photo op, wouldn't you say? If it works. You mean, if it doesn't kill us all? Adam? You're back. Uh, can I speak to you outside? I don't like this. Get to the helipad, son. You're going back to Hengcha Island. Frank tracked down one of the GPLs. Only one? Is it? Sevchenko's. But Adam, we had to call in a favor of the DOD to do it. Meaning, the conspirators probably know I'm coming. Beautiful. It's gonna be action, but I can do it. Not the first time. 
I don't like this mysterious man here, bodyguards, they're augmented, you can see on their head. To the helipad, okay. <laughs> it's Shevchenko, it's not our lady. I forgot her name, unfortunately. <laughs> mm, I think I went wrong. Yep. Okay, I will turn it on for you. Enjoy. Jesus. Malik is outside of the helicopter. It's not a helicopter. Boss said we're heading back to yeah. Pritchard tracks up Chenko's GPL signal. If he's alive, there's a chance the rest of them are too. That's a pretty big leap, Jensen. We've been making big leaps for a while now. Whatever you say. You ready to get going? No time like the present. Let's get going. Then hop in. It's a modern helicopter. B008. Bazooka! What the hell? We've got a sand left on our tail. <laughs> Jensen, all systems are down. Oh. Hang on, we're going in hard. Stop, Jensen! I hope Malik is all right. Malik, we've got company. I know, but the bird took some damage. Gonna need to patch it up before I can go. I'll stay and cover you. Negative. You need to get away from here and find Dr. Savchenko. I'll be fine. You'll be a sitting duck. Maybe, maybe not. But this is your best chance to slip by them unnoticed, and you know it. So get out of here, Jensen. I cannot leave you, Malik. No, 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 Malik, I cannot let you die. No, 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 no. I have to help her. Shit, shit, shit. Malik, we've got company. I know, but the bird took some damage. Gonna need to patch it up before I can go. I'll stay and cover you. Negative. You need to get away from here and find Dr. Savchenko. I'll be fine. You'll be a sitting duck. Maybe, maybe not. But this is your best chance to slip by them unnoticed, and you know it. So get out of here, Jensen. Why did I take revolver now?
hurt. <laughs> Just a scratch, spy boy. But I think... Uh, I think you're on your own now. Farida. Give them hell for me. Malik! Malik! This guy killed me! How stupid can I be? Oh my god. Malik, we've got company. I know, but the bird took some damage. Gonna need to patch it up before I can go. I'll stay and cover you. Negative! You need to get away from here and find Dr. Savchenko. I'll be fine. You'll be a sitting duck. Maybe, maybe not. But this is your best chance to slip by them unnoticed, and you know it. So get out of here, Jensen. Jesus. I want to kill them all. I want to know can I can I save her? I don't want to sneak past by them while they attacking her. I'll stay and cover you. Negative. You need to get away from here and find Dr. Savchenko. I'll be fine. You'll be a sitting duck. Maybe, maybe not. But this is your best chance to slip by them unnoticed, and you know it. So get out of here, Jensen. She died. Fuck. I tried Malik, I really did. Now that we know that Malik actually dies, I'm gonna try to sneak by them. Okay. 
Malik, we've got company. I know, but the bird took some damage. Gonna need to patch it up before I can go. I'll stay and cover you. Negative. You need to get away from here and find Dr. Sachenko. I'll be fine. Don't be a sitting duck. Maybe, maybe not. But this is your best chance to slip by them unnoticed, and you know it. So get out of here, Jensen. <laughs> I'm sorry, my leg. I really am. I I did my best. You out of here yet, spy boy? Malik. Just find Vasily. Jensen, keep him safe. Go to hell. You bastard, Farina! I think there's a way if I kill them pretty fast that I can save her honestly. I think there's Jensen, a way. I've been monitoring calm activity around Hengsha. Bell Tower's looking for you. Hard. Bastards ambushed us, Pritchard. Malik didn't make it. Oh god. I I know you might want to get even. But if they see you, if they recognize you. It might be better to stay out of their way. Oh my god. Malik died. And she was with us since the beginning. I really grew, grew some emotions towards her. And... Yeah, it's sad. It is sad. No helicopter anymore. Well, the hell is going on? Everyone that's argumented, having some problems, including me. Well, guys, that's gonna be it for today's episode. I hope you enjoyed. Unfortunately, Malik died, and it's a sad day. If you enjoyed the episode, please hit a like, leave a comment. Leave F in the comment section below for my league. And I see you guys at the next episode. Have a good day. Elbaku signs off. Bye bye.